Good morning, ESM. I'm Amber. And I'm David. Today is January 23rd. And hopefully you've heard the buzz by now about our school musical. Which is Rogers and Hammerstein's Cinderella. This year, a nice contrast from Mamma Mia last year. Yeah. More info about the show, dates, and how to get involved after news and announcements. The eSports company 100 Thieves has completed construction on the largest eSports facility in the U.S. in Los Angeles, clocking in at 15,000 square feet. The ribbon cutting ceremony was yesterday and the 100 Thieves Cash App compound was opened. The facility has an outdoor basketball court and an arcade as well as rooms dedicated to prof professional gaming. Some rooms in the buildings are specific to different games with a Fortnite room, a CSGO room, and a League of Legends room. The facility will occasionally be open to the public, specifically when new merch drops for the company. Thursday, just after 5 a.m. in Baldwinsville, a kitchen fire alerted fire crews along with the New York State Police to a home on River Road. The exact cause of the fire is yet to be determined and police say that there were no injuries. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. If you need or want to make an announcement on the morning show, please email it to wesm at esmschools.org before 8.15 of the morning of you want it to go on. So as we mentioned earlier, the musical this year is Cinderella, but it's not the classic Disney version. Although a similar story, Ella, a.k.a. Cinderella, is introduced as a young girl with a terrible home life after her father's passing. Her stepmother and two sisters, Charlotte and Gabrielle, <laughs> are not quite family and uh, follow their mother's goal of reaching the lower upper class. <laughs> However, when Prince Topher and his guardian of sorts, Sebastian, decide to throw a ball to wed the prince in order to save the, save the kingdom, according to Sebastian, <laughs> Madame sees it as her entryway into the upper class. So with some help from Crazy Marie, who turns out to be Ella's fairy godmother, Ella is able to go to the dance in a facade without Madame's knowing. But the magic wears off by midnight, as it does in the Disney version. So she returns again the next night to meet Topher again and leaves her glass slipper on the steps as a clue for him to come find the real her. Meanwhile, lower class member Jean-Michel is battling both social hi hierarchy as well as love as he falls in love with Gabrielle, one of the stepsisters. Eager to find out how the story ends, you can catch the four shows available on March 5th, 6th, and 7th with showcasings each night at 7 with a matinee on Saturday at 2. Tickets will be sold at the door, but if you want to really make sure that you have a spot, you can buy your ticket at www.esmchs.booktix.com where you can view seating as well as which seats are already taken. So now that we've thoroughly explained the show to you, After Weather will explain how you can get involved. Today we have mixed sun and clouds with a high of 38. Friday will be mostly cloudy with a high of 40. Saturday we will have mixed rain and snow with a high of 36. Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday there will be expected snow showers with highs in the mid to low 30s. Wednesday we will have mixed cloud and clouds, sun and clouds with a high of 32. I'm Gabby with your weather. So there are still many opportunities to get involved in the show this year. So there's construction crew where you help build the sets, costume crew where you dress the state, well, dress the characters, lighting and sound, and so much more. We still need lots of hands to help us out in the next few months. And even if you don't want to dedicate too much time, there are still options for you. Ushers, community service hours are like, if you need them for whether it's uh, National Honor Society or just because you're a senior. They're very easy to get, and you just you, you come on show nights and you you know help open doors, uh, hand out programs, and things like that. So if you're interested in being in the show this year in any way, find your email, Mr. Brandon, about details and signing up. Now on to sports. So, let's just scroll. Thank you for being involved, or 
Just wait until we get to our script. Okay, cool. <laughs> Just more, just one more final plug for the show. It is going to be on March 5th, 6th, and 7th, and tickets can be bought online at www.esmchs.booktix.com. Whether you want to be involved or just come and see your classmates in the show, it will definitely be a great show, and it will be a lot of fun. That just about wraps it up for us today. So from Amber, myself, and everyone here at The Morning Show, make it a great day or not, the choice is yours.